So let me switch this item out. Uh, it is usual for you, Dragon. Been enjoying some great games lately. <laughs> yeah, the the uh, the great Ace Attorney. Yeah, the, there's been some good games that came out this last month. I'm. I finished Skyward Sword HD yesterday, and so I've been focusing on Monster Hunter Stories 2 and Great Ace Attorney. Uh, so, Gary, you can have the 30 second delay for you, Sone. Can you try uh, refreshing? I don't think it should be. Is there a delay for you, Dragon? There really shouldn't be. Like. Uh, finished all the... Oh, Game Builder uh, tutorials included 50 extra checkpoints. Target first game based on text adventure. Got, got the room going. Seven seconds now? Okay, that's, that's a bit better. Uh, let's give Gary... Do the leftovers we've been doing for a lot of a lot of moms. We have so many leftovers. Uh, might do, might just do that. I could do quick claw, but I well I like quick claw and normal gameplay. It's RNG, and I. The less RNG we have in this, the better. So let's, let's do leftovers. Where are leftovers? Oh, I passed them again. Leftovers are... There we go. Okay, so let's knock out this sixth gym. Let's try to finish knocking it out. I'm nervous still. I don't remember even how the opponent levels were. Strongman Christian. Can you first person lock the cabin trying to figure out how to escape? Uh I mean probably can't do with the tech with the with tech a lot of text because of the way game builder garage is, but you're gonna like make it into an actual like non-text adventure. I hope it turns out good. You'll have to share it online when Share the uh, code or whatever when you finish. Okay, Tropia is bad. Tropia is bad. Uh, so pretty bad. Gary might. Does Gary have a good poison attack? No, no poison attacks. No poison attacks, huh? Into zone, I think, have a poison attack. We should see if we have a poison TM for Gary. I don't know if we checked that before. Oh, let's, uh... Fast forward the, uh... There we go. As we've been doing, because... Just to speed it up a little, the... This is a long game. Oh, thank you for the follow. Uh, okay. The Tropia shouldn't be a threat here. We're actually fairly, fairly decent level right now for what we're facing. Make object invisible, put texture of transparencies, you can do wonders. Oh yeah, yeah, I've, I've been doing, I've, I've done stuff like that. Crap, I looked away. Almanite. Oh, this is actually fine. In fact, this is actually exactly what I want to use. Thunderbolt. Okay, so let's real quickly, before I forget, 
check our TMs again, see if we have a poison. I feel like we did, we checked. We have poison jab. Oh yeah, we did check, but Gengar's a special attacker. And this is all we had. And it didn't seem worth it. Alright, we can play a solo trip with the main gameplay down. Yeah, that's fair. It's always easy to change the, uh, the graphics later. Person 1 type 3 is his strength and weakness of that Pokemon. But you're not... Oh, Operator Maryland. I guess you have... You are focused on one type. It's a dual type, but still. You only have one Pokemon. Uh... This actually should be fine. Ancient power should be super effective. Oh, and we, we got the, uh, the buff. That's always nice. Too bad it's for a one turn that doesn't matter. <laughs> we got the buff twice in a row. I think those are the first times we've gotten the buff with the Ancient Power, and it didn't even matter right now. Okay, so now... Okay, even though we're here, I don't know if we're going to need Sonic's Ancient Power, and it's out of PP pretty much. So we are going to real quick run back and heal, and then we have Gym Leader number 6. And with that, hopefully, hopefully we'll clear it and only have two more gems. Of course, we have most of the Team Galactic lot still to do. Because that's kind of how it works in Pokemon games. They, they earlier on they'll they'll sprinkle some stuff with the evil team, but then like usually, usually after the seventh gym is when they decide to like suddenly do plot, give or take a little. And so I'm guessing that's how they do it here. It's been a while, but. sure we didn't miss any trainers. That was just a genuine I went the wrong way. Okay. Yep, here we go. Even though we've hardly done anything so far, let's a quick save and take on whoever this is. Uh, it's Orberg Jim. Dad, just he is he defeat my son. That's no surprise more to learn. Place my son for our I, Byron, will take her challenge. I forgot that was his. that Byron is for our son, uh, father. Trainer Liliana. Okay, we're starting with a clay doll. Grounded psychic, I believe. Either way, oh god, are we, are we at risk? Does water take neutral from ground? Or is, cause if it's, if it's this ground, we're fine. What else do I have if I don't want to take a chance? Do clues. Okay, how many stats again? Uh, Really bad speed. Ploof. We, we... I don't want to take a chance that I'm forgetting my... Resistances. I'm not as good at remembering resistances as... I, I remember all weaknesses. I can do that. Oh, great. Now we have... Was that spikes or was that toxic spikes? Either way, it's... Okay, well, substitute. Can't hurt you this turn. I 
hope we don't need a switch, but we probably will. Fluffy would be level 28, nice. Dragon Rush. Ooh. Oh yeah, accuracy is... Yeah, I mean, it's notably stronger, but... 75 accuracy is really unreliable. What's this? 80. No, we're, we're gonna... Go up and Dragon Rush. It's too, it's too risky. Especially with the dragon move. <sighs> no, I'm gonna worry about the spikes right now. I'm just gonna keep... Uh, energy ball. Growth, okay. Holy crap, that was a really not a good crit. Flinch. Ah. Oh yeah, crap, it goes first. I should have just I should have just attacked or That was risky. That was really risky. If he had been it again, he got another. Oh boy. Get out of here, Vigora. That was almost really bad. We almost lost Bluff. Carvana. Normally I'd keep this out. Wait, wait we have a substitute up. We have a substitute up. We're, we're gonna... We're gonna try to see if we one-shot it, but as soon as substitute breaks, we're out of here. Okay, we one-shot it. I, I thought I remember Carvana has pretty bad defenses, both special and physical. I think it's pretty frail. Plus it was unevolved. Woo! Ploof managed to sweep his whole team. Good job, Ploof. Uh, we're gonna spell you this mind badge. Strength outside of battle. Team 91. Mean luck. I mean, mean luck sucks, but I'm not sure if that was the proper explanation. Yeah, that stops them from fleeing. It looks actually not horrible, but like, it's not worth using a slot. Like an item, or a move slot. You better not challenge me to a battle. Uh, I'm in the library. Since when do you slow down enough to like stop and like read books? All you do is run, run, run. I'm not taking any chances. We are healing up Ploof. Now, I guess we're going to the library for some lore. And third floor. Yeah. This is the slowest I've ever seen you walk. Okay, we're gonna throw shit out like I said. Alright, I'll be out of here. Okay, of course you are. Okay, I get it. Oh, yep. yep. Everyone's here. Shout out everyone listening. If you're already studying evolution of Pokemon, why are studying more mysteries appear and multiply? Pokemon that evolve and those that don't. What makes them different from each other? Do those that are immature as living beings evolve to ones more mature? If so, 
what do we make of the legendary Pokemon that don't evolve? We assume the legendary Pokemon are complete as creatures. Three, three come in. The three lakes in other are said to be Mirage Pokemon. If you obtain data on them, it makes you light on how the process of Pokemon evolution works. Need help from each one of you in this grand undertaking. We find these Pokemon that are considered to be Mirages. What are you saying? I don't didn't get no Pokedex. And who, who is it that bolted from the lab for I had a chance to give you a Pokedex? That's water under the bridge. You can poke with your own eyes is important for you becoming a better trainer too. Yep, Professor, I'll add this to the Pokedex database to help advance your research. I'd meet all you go regardless, anyway. I have the three lakes. Fortuitously, there are three of you. You should therefore split up and investigate the lakes individually. Lucas, you go to Lake Verity? Yes, sir. Chad, JB, I want you to investigate Lake Acuity. That would take you almost to Snow Point City. Heard there's harsh. Need a tough trainer to go. Uh, yeah, of course. Gramps, you know what I call it. You can tell I'm the hotness. <laughs> and at least shout out with Lake Valor. Lake is between Vealstone and Pestoria, if memory serves. Uh-oh. Can you stop? Are you unharmed? It's about to be careful. I'm concerned about the city. That was a very short earthquake. Where of aftershocks. Does this area get earthquakes a lot, or was that a bad sign? A tremor, there was a natural occurrence. Hey, hey, old dude and kid, something big just happened. They're saying there's a huge explosion at Lake Valor. Boom, like that. Gramps, I'm going to the lake. I have a bad feeling about this. JV, you can't sit still. And we're at Lake Valor. I have no idea what's taking place. Let's find out before you go to the stress. Don't get it over your head. Try to join you soon to inspect Lake Verity. Lake Valor, I wonder what happened. So, uh. That must have been a pretty big dang explosion if it was felt on the other side of the region. Okay. Well. We need Fly. Do we have a living Pokemon with Fly? I think it would be cheating to switch in one of our dead Pokemon to Fly. I don't remember if... Not you. Not you. Not you. Not you. Oops, I... And check last. Either you. Okay. Now we gotta teach somebody to fly then. Cool. Actually, let me look at everybody's moves in a party. Okay. Had to go away for a bit. Do we make it past Gym 6? Yeah, we beat Gym 6. Uh. Ploof almost died, held on with 5 HP, and managed to sweep the gym. It was very scary. And granted, it almost died because it substituted after taking a hit that same turn, and the substitute brought it to 5 HP. Okay, so here's special. So, Headbutt's not that great. So, Headbutt's a candidate to switch out. I like that moveset. Uh, that moveset's pretty good, too. What are you, physical or special? Oh, you prefer to split. Ah, I don't want to teach fly to any of these. Time to actually, for once, have a uh, HM slave. Who am I least likely to ever use? Is there anybody that had a really bad ability? No. Um, uh, we probably won't use... Oh, this is hard. I feel like Eradicate has a low chance of being used. Ok, 
it up to the UI again. Oh, yeah, you are correct. I need to fix the badge situation. Uh, thank you. Boop. There we go. Okay, so... Fluffy will put you there momentarily. And Macho Man, you are fitting. I feel like R Radicate often is used as a, an HM slave, so... Granted, it's not usually given fly, but... I need the badge of the more luster, like when you could rub them on the touchscreen. <laughs> Sadly, that's not an option with the, uh, the way this all works, so I can't do that. But let's first, before we go where we need to go, let's check the daycare. I don't remember, of course, it's been two weeks. I don't remember who's in the daycare. I don't remember what level they were or needed to get to. Daddy for Sheldon. Uh, obviously two weeks for the daycare. Yeah, if only that that actually though that'd really break the game. So thank goodness. Thank goodness that's not a thing. Like last thing we want. Like you want you want the. Uh, you want the Nuzlocke to be interesting. Just managing to get a level 100 Pokemon to the daycare would kind of... Dottie. What is Dottie and what is Sheldon? Sheldon's a Shieldin. Sheldon's a Shieldin and he's at level 30. But I don't know what the heck Dottie was. Dottie is a... I'm about to get that. That's... You need the level 36, okay. Nope, Dottie, get back in there. Oops, I didn't want to press that button. There we go. Okay, so we need to get to it like Valor. Come on, Macho Man, fly us to... Uh, I guess is closer. Put Macho Man back out of the party. If only Fly was in a two-turn move, because that other- if Fly was not a two-turn move, I'd just have it in the party, but it's about as useless as Flash. We don't have Flash yet, do we? Because there was a cave that needed Flash. No, we don't have Flash. Huh. I might have missed it, but oh well. Maybe Flash is optional on this one. Playing a little more Pokemon Unite, friends are more into than you are, but you suck it. The mobile game is still fun. I mean, it, or the mobile genre, you suck it. Yeah, it's, it's very much a thing that you need to practice. Like, most competitive games, practice is a thing. And so, like, if, if you want to be a guy out of MOBA, you gotta practice a MOBA. Like, that's all there is down to learn when to retreat, when to fight, when to go assist somebody. It helps to stick with only a couple, a few different poke, or a few different characters to uh, make sure that you don't spread yourself too thin on learning each one. I've at this point, 
I, I, have, a, I have a few. I, I have... My most common are Krusel, Zerora, and... Uh... Eldegoss, though I sometimes... I've been dabbling with Talonflame, and I've tried a few other ones. It's a bit hardcore, more casual, a little more casual with it. Yeah, I mean... Unite is very simple for a MOBA. So there's that upside. It's a, it's a more... If there's such thing as a casual MOBA, it's a casual MOBA. But you do have to still practice to be good at anything like that. Any any competitive game requires practice to be good at. Okay. Huh. You're like Absol is speedster. Uh, I don't know if what Absol's. I haven't even tried Absol. Uh, but yeah, if it's good with jungling, then sure, I I'll take your word for it. Either way. Uh, you still have to make sure to work as a team and not just be off doing your own thing, because otherwise they can overwhelm the rest of your team while you're jungling. Like Faraday, the closest civilization is that hick town called Twin Leaf. We can roll in there completely unopposed. Uh, they just blew up the right lake, which I think they had explosives that we knew about. Up. Oh. like to join the magic or flop around in the mud? No, thank you. I'm good. Oh, I wonder what Magikarp falls into in this. Cyclist Chloe. Back with the evil cyclists. With a Cherim. Cherim is not that much of a threat, but it is to Sonic. Get out of there. Uh... In the zone. You need your poison attack. It's the only thing that... I'm gonna do blue for playing play character. This is probably better. Because they're evil cyclists because they want to wish the cycle balance of life. They, they must want to wish the cycle balance of life with the green. Oh, to end the cycle. Wouldn't they, that be the opposite of a cyclist if they want to end the cycle? They're not very good cyclists, they're anti cyclists. Then again, I don't think they want to end it. I think they want to reboot it, which is kind of like continuing the cycle. So. Mill tank. Okay, well. Sonic, I think you can handle a mill tank, I hope. You need some XP, so. That's ancient power. Belly drum. That could be really good or really bad. I hope we can finish off with this. Ooh. Okay, its attack is maxed out and it outspeeds us. Mega kick. Oh, phew, it missed. Even resisted, I was a little worried with it maxed out attack. Okay, Sonic, level 35. Overwhelming. Lady for a child and paid a stiff price for my arrogance. How very much too late. Team Black has already found the sunken island under the lake and the Pokemon lay in it. Well, what do you think? Uh, I wanted to check what this says. Doesn't seem close to hatching, dang. So it's gonna be a while. Hmm, I you need black to know your magic are worthless all of them. Ouch! You know they could all evolve into Gyarados, so ma imagine Team Galactic, just just think about it for a moment. You can't have an army of like a hundred Gyarados. Why would you not want that? 
sure, an electric Pokemon could sweep that entire army, but like, otherwise, they're pretty destructive. Kangaskhan. Okay, well let's let's try it. Ancient power. Camouflage. Now it's rock type. Great. So ancient power is now resisted. I think. Oh, rock doesn't resist rock. Let's surf anyway. Back tile, I think we still got that. Uh, I haven't even looked at the video for the DLC for Snap yet. I kind of just want to go in and be surprised by most of what's in there. But I did hear Gyarados is in there, unfortunately. I'm trying to though, avoid knowing what's in there. No, you didn't spoil anything, I already... Pe people talked about it already, so... But I look forward to seeing what it looks like, and and what it's doing and stuff. Happiny, well, Happiny's a baby Pokemon. Should be easy. And again, it's probably tanky because the Chansey line is. Uh, wish doesn't that heal next turn? For this turn? Okay. So you've you made your original is really special. I just loved Evolution at being in the original. I wish they kept that. That's like the one thing I'm disappointed about with the new one. The, probably the only thing. Because otherwise it's phenomenal. But like, I've, I love the Evolution stuff. But yeah, Gyarados was... Gyarados was a whole thing to try to get in the original. Abusing the crap out of that magic card. Mike with a Clefairy. Back before Fairy type. Not the supplies right now, because I'm just going to uh, Ancient Power. They have a lot of normal types. Jeez, we've been facing mostly normal types with these this group of cyclists. Star. Oh wow, that's our self. Uh, let's nah, let's do Ploof. Get out of there. That. In the zone. and Veilstone is where you're taking them, okay. I don't think there's, is there anything in here? Up. Oh. Do you have any regular potions? We're about to be in a battle. Save just because. I haven't saved in like 20 minutes. Mission of proceeding without a hitch. Posh should be pleased. Everything is for everyone and for the good of Team Galactic. Recognize your face of the child who raided the Team Galactic building in Eterna. 
Jupiter should be ashamed of herself being beaten by a child. For anything and anyone that opposes Dean Black must be crushed, even the very thought of opposition will not be tolerated. Oh, you're about to get defeated by a child, too. Leader Jasmine. I forgot the admins are leaders, which works still. Wait, freaking Celebi? Really? That took me a minute to register, dang! Uh, it's not a great thing to see right now. Oh god. If only Sonic- uh, I don't think we outspeed it. If we could outspeed it, Signal Beam would be amazing, but it might have a grass attack and one-shot us. <laughs> yeah, I miss Serapy. Serapy was really useful. Sonic could have taken a confusion, dang. Could have probably one shot it with Signal Beam. Because that does times four. Oh, I'll have to blaze kick it. Keep kicking it, Ploof. Okay, Miracle Eye. Okay, that doesn't do anything, right? I think that makes Psychic in the dark. Okay, easy. I, I was more worried than I needed to be. Drapion. Ugh. Poison bug, it's dark bug. What am I saying? Where's the poison dark? I think it's part I think it's dark. Bug. I think it's bug dark. Yeah, I love that you're poisoned. Okay. I don't feel safe. In the zone out there. Uh, world, I guess. Of course. Oh, hey, Shell. How are you? God, stop with the sleep powder! Uh, I'm doing well, thanks. We just got through the, uh, sixth, sixth gym a little while ago, so we're... Only have two gyms left, but we are stuck in this endless battle with this awful admin who keeps putting our into zone to sleep. Okay. Wait, you so many wait. Ah, stop it! Sleep is busted. Sleep is just. We're out of awakenings now. Do I want to start wasting full heals? Whatever. I'm, I'm just gonna wait for us to wake up. We used four awakenings and. Just I don't even know if he could hurt us. All he's doing is poison jab and sleep powder. Does this thing have anything other than poison jab? Oh, it has sludge, which also can't hurt us. There we go. Shift tree. Okay, uh... Have. I forgot, you have fighting steel. I know those are helpful. I forgot he had another Pokemon. Of course, 
しあ,あのくっくっくっくっくっくっくっくっくっくっくっくっくっくっくっくっくっくっくっくっくっくっくっくっくっくっくっくっくっくっくっくっくっくっくっくっくっ Out the payback. Yeah, it, it's easy on Twitch to like miss greeting people. Like, you just kind of just pop in and just start talking. I, I understand that. Fluffy's level 30. Maybe someday Fluffy will actually be usable. Get out of here. Charlie, you never will stun the flow of time, get the three legendary Pokemon Lake for a power create an entirely new universe. Our ship capture Pokemon Lake for Verity. Okay, let's use an antidote. Because I don't think we make it out, and I don't think it's until Gen 5 that Pokemon no longer would faint when, uh, when poison, out of battle when poisoned. Taking a 20 minute meditation break. I'm relaxing. We used a lot of items in that battle, but on the upside we didn't lose anybody, which I felt was an actual risk in that battle, so... Super potions. Yeah, I get some more super potions. We have no shortage of money right now. Antidotes. Actually, I'm gonna get more antidotes. Once again, we have no shortage of money. Let's stack up with 10 of every one of these stat healer or status healers. To help install a curve in earlier at the start of this. Ah! Fun, fun. What am I doing? I have 10 of those. Burn heals. Let's get five more. Got all the Shantae's in physical form except for Pirate's Curse, which went up in price. 
that's five, around $500 for Pirate's Curse? Jeez. I'll be honest, if I had, if I had Pirate's Curse for that price, I'd just, I'd sell it. Like, I get it there's a value in having the physical version, but like, that's, that's a fair bit of change. There's a lot of things I could, even 300, there's a lot of things I could buy with that $300. And I have Pirate's Curse on two platforms already anyways. Uh, we don't need, oops, just gonna have three of them. We don't, we don't need a lot of those because we can always buy them when we escape. But in case I forget. getting a bunch of max repels because I feel like we're coming up to a lot of caves. When we run stuff ends up tempting you, don't want us to come to them all the time. Yeah. Yeah, I've actually... I've actually never gotten a limited run game because they're always pricier, obviously, than the, just getting it normally on the digital version and... I don't have the money to the expendable income to just spend on those. Even if some have been very tempting. Yeah, Scott Pilgrim was probably get a good one to do. If I did one, I don't know, it'd, it'd be some sort of indie game. I, I don't off the top of my head remember all the limited runs, but... Like all the limited runs for games that I care about, but oof, waiting months for it. That's that's rough. Let's see. Where do? Oh yeah, their hideout. Their hideout in Veilstone, I believe they said that they or the sto storage place. This place. Get regular edition limited run number here is the only one to explore. Spamming Philistine was not in that. Yeah, that's was a disappointing thing to hear without even having it. I was just like, how could they forget Philistine? Or Phil Philistine. Uh Shantae and the Seven Sirens. I I have a I have a digital. I have every Shantae game digitally, but I don't have a limited run of any of them. Since you're now officially just an HM slave, I'm gonna separate you. Oh, Dragon, you should get a Shanta game. Shanta games are really fun. Uh, Seven Sirens was excellent. It's. I don't know if I'd say it was the best one in my opinion, but it. Because. It was the third one. Ris Ris uh, no. Half Genie Hero. Half Genie Hero is probably the best one. But Seven Sirens is really great. Yeah, Half Genie Hero DLC, I, I ended up... That's why I double dipped on Half Genie Hero, was because the DLC came out and I didn't want to dig out my Wii U just for, uh, the DLC on that, so I just bought it again on when it was on sale on Switch. And then bought the DLC, but I backed half, half Genie Hero. It was great. Weakest one is indeed the original, but it, yeah, it is still fun. It is, yeah, it's, I'd say it's one of the best Game Boy Color. It might be the best Game Boy Color like platformer. It might be. It's hard to pick because Warrior Land was, I think, Game Boy Color, wasn't it? I think it was Warrior Land too. But like, yeah, it is one of the best best ones at. Or Bus Game Boy Color Games. It is the weakest one just by comparison. It is the hardest one though. Warland 2 and 3 were yeah. It is the hardest one in the series, the first Shantae. And I wouldn't unless somebody's adamant on playing them in order, I wouldn't recommend it to people that want to try to see if they like the series because it could turn them away with their di its difficulty, but But if you're already adamant on playing them all, and you don't mind starting with the hardest one, because there is continuity. 
Otherwise, yeah, it'd probably be the help. If you, if you, I, I don't know. What, whenever you'd want to get a, get to a really hard one, but yeah, dragon. They go on sale often. Uh, I recommend putting them on your like Switch uh, eShop wish list so you can see when they're on sale. I have all of them. All the ones I don't have on Switch, I have on the eShop wish list for when they go on sale because I couldn't double dip for those ones. I have them all on some system, but. I'd like to have them all on Switch at some point. Okay, so this was this was a waste of time. Cool. I'm getting very distracted talking, but like this was nothing here. Deals the various website for tracking discounts. Uh, yeah, it is. Uh, for Switch, I think it's easy enough just to put it on wish list if you want to get it on Switch. Uh, Master Mighty F Champs and Mil Mighty Milky Way. That'd be interesting. Uh, yeah, I had Mighty Switch for it. It was it was pretty good. It wasn't like a must play game in my opinion, but it was fun. I'm kind of happy with WayForward now working on first-party Nintendo stuff. Like, I'd like to see them do more of that, to be honest. Is it Turner City they went to? Like, I'd like to see them remaster the other Advance Wars games. They could do some others. And I like, honestly, I think they should handle a new Advance Wars game. I think the Advance Wars series would be in good hands with them. Yeah, I don't think it's here. Okay, air zoo. Hopefully, get them done. With it. Okay, have a uh, have a good evening, zone, and I'll hopefully see you later. Maybe. Good good luck getting your errands done before before you scream. Uh, Castlevania. Yeah, I mean they could do a castle. The one thing that I can't can't think of them nailing the feel of Castlevania, but maybe they could. Okay, so it's not here. Where where do go? Okay, well first of all I can use I can use HM strength now. And that opens up stuff. Uh I know Mount Corona. I'm trying to remember if anywhere else needs strength. Some place else probably does. But I'm probably gonna forget it. You know what? I'm gonna check Lake Verity first. <laughs> I don't know how he finished his ends. A little apprehensive about WayForward doing a new advance towards admittedly not too familiar with the work. Uh, I mean. I wouldn't. If they weren't handling an Advance Wars remake, I wouldn't want them handling a new Advance Wars because. I'd worry they wouldn't be good at the field, but with a uh, with a remake takes no effort, so they can do the or like a no. They don't have to do anything too creative that will like make them like it, it's easy enough for them to stick to the field. And once they get the feel of that, I think they can do a new one. Tiny Team Black Scoundrels after Legendary Pokemon help. Oh, just got it. Oh. Well, let me switch Macho Man out, because... There's no PC here, is there? <sighs> I'll just fly over to Sand Gem. I got the feel. I wonder if you know how to do the balance part. Maybe a good story to accept the prize. Uh, the balance part... The problem is that Advanced Wars was always horribly unbalanced. So they honestly can't be any worse at balancing it than Nintendo was. No offense. Much love to Advance Wars. But it was a very unbalanced game. And I've seen a lot of like a lot of people's wish lists and things that Way Forward does this remake is address the balancing issues, either at launch or post launch with updates. 
Granted, balancing a game like that is very hard. But at the very least, they could balance the uh, commanding officers and find a way to make mech spam not the best strategy. Like... Double battle, that makes me nervous. But yeah, they they uh, they can't do any worse with the balancing, so like and honestly the game even being an unbalanced mess is still really fun. So that's a secondary thing. I'd love it if they make sure it's nice and balanced so that the multiplayer is that much better. But single player bounce is less irrelevant. Using max spam, while it will win almost any battle, it won't work on maps where you really heavily need to use air and sea. And it will also get you poor ranks in single player runs because it'll take so long. And uh, you have less freedom over which commanding officers you use. So them being unbalanced isn't a big deal. Okay, so kind of worried. Both of these are weak to something there. So would Ploof be? Okay, we'll switch Gary in. In the zone doesn't really. The fighting's what I'm worried about here. Spikes, lovely. Girls paralyzed. Well, good. That needle arm, that would have been pretty bad for Sonic, so that was nice to switch in. Resist it instead of a double weakness. Uh. Do Shadow Ball. Or Zelia. Actually, no. We will do Shadow Ball. We need to get the hair across out first. We'll focus everything there. Okay. I think obviously we're going to take it out, but I was worried it was going to do something out speed. Somehow. Alright, the Thunderbolt's resisted here, but that was good damage despite being resisted. Oh, cool. Sleep. It's just gonna be two on one, so this is gonna be easy now. Low tech. Aw, oh, frick, it has a fighting move. Okay, that wasn't too bad. Uh, rock smash and spin duh. If you wake up, that is. And Thunderbolt. Thunderbolt, we don't even need the Thunderbolt. Good job, Gary. 